Welcome back, one and all, to the Brexit Estate, hard by the Darkest Dungeon, where I'm starting to get the impression that if I wasn't playing with Crimson Court content, I might have actually finished this game by now. And you know what? I love this game, but it would be nice to actually complete it at some point. I mean, I've been playing it for the last four years and loving every piece of it, and restarting every time Reynold or Dismas dies, but that's neither here nor there. And so far, this run is actually going surprisingly well. Now, it's time to try and track down the Countess once again, probably unsuccessfully, and I should take lots of provisions. I mean, basically everything, right? Apart from keys. I'm gonna need extra torches, take some extra blood, Right, let's see. Got food. Got torches. Got bandages. Got the free things. Holy water, medicinal herbs, and... and uh, Anti-venom. Alright. Now, I do have lots of money, so I can afford to oversupply a bit. If I take extra bandages and spades, just to be on the safe side, I think I can head back in there. So, here we go. I'm, you know, hoping I get lucky, but hey, if I don't, I don't. I'm feeling relatively positive today. As long as nothing too bad happens, right? I mean, look, you know, the last, <laughs> last few days have been a bit bad, let's say. And things are looking up now, so of course now this game's going to kick me in the guts and make me feel horrible and miserable again, but hey, I'll try. When this torch stops flickering and it's time to load. But yeah, I mean, I hope you've all been doing well and having a nice time. I've got a few things going on and, you know, things are kind of just about okay at the moment, but could definitely be better. It's just one of those moments where I'm I'm kind of just scraping by and very pleased to be doing so. Oh, there we go. I think that's it. Uh, the game did take a rather long time to load the Hamlet. There we go, yes. And immediately the susurrating insect swarms are back. And we are... Where are we? We are going this way. Why are we going this way? Ah, we're going round to establish the pattern. Okay. There was something in there that I didn't get to interact with because I didn't have a supply item and I cannot for the life of me remember what it was. However, I do have spades. Is that... that is bloodlust, it's not, um, the other one. It's not a craving. That's a craving. We'll fix that in the next fight. We do have spades and we're here for the treasure. Okay, we can work with this. Probably ditch those for money in a little bit. But for now, let's press ever so gingerly on. And hopefully, in our timid traipsing, we shall come across something of great worth to us. Or great in gold. gold. Trinkets and baubles. Paid for in blood. Okay, there we go. So we don't need these so much in town at the moment. And we're mostly here for the money. Also, of course, we've got the classic team here. Sister Senna, Vernon, Sir Rosnav, and late well... She ain't no lady, but Saren, she's a beast of that halberd when it comes to minions of the Crimson Court. As we are about to discover, or rediscover. Oh, you shouldn't have done that to Vernon. You know what, he's just gonna sidle back like that. Because he's a slippery so-and-so, so he is. Oh, and you missed. Oh well, better luck next time, eh? 
Uh, this could be bad. Nobody moved. We're all good. Alright, steady. Steady. There we go, that's great. Thunder Vestal! Okay, gotta keep using this stuff. Protect everyone. Because we want to make it through here alive! Alright, and bleed? Yeah! Deaded. She is deaded. Uh oh. That's actually some kind of semi serious damage now. Come on. Use for supply items. It's for your own good, man. Uh, we'll even guard him as he's looking a little bit vulnerable right now. Inspiration and improvement. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. So, as usual, when entering the Crimson Court, our goal is to attempt to make it out of as much treasure as possible to try and make it cost-effective. However, also achieving our goal in here would be grand as well. Okay, let's go for a party boost. Not a Cadbury's boost, party boost. Somewhat different. Oh, nice! Okay, can you kill it? Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Yes, you can! Okay. We're looking to have this encounter relatively under control at the moment. But that is a, you know, somewhat considerable amount of stress for this earlier stage in the run. If Hellion had repost, she'd be obscene. Unfortunately, that's not the case. Hey, bleed for me, little insect man of doom. Thank you. Alright, put a bit of healing there. Well, that's not good. Give them no quarter. But we'll take it. I'm gonna go for the buff so that the riposte is even more nasty if he becomes a target. Alright, just Thunder Vestalet. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Because that works as well. Oh, that's just not fair. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Alright, let us try not to be overconfident. We want all this money. We want this tapestry and we want that ruby. We've used most of these and while we might need some more, we're not going to need that many more. Uh, we can theoretically heal for any bleeds and blights, but we did bring extra bandages. Okay. The Duke tapestry is worth an amazing four and a half thousand. So at this point, we're basically making profit whatever happens. Okay, is this going to mirror? I think it's going to mirror and the door will be down there. I also have a blue. I've been there before. Unless I... Oh no, this is just scouting wall. Okay. Do we have a torch? Yes, we do. Okay. Ooh. You know what? 9, 10, 18, sure. There we go. Things are trundling along nicely. Now, who was that? Who got bad? Okay. You got bad. Well, you know what? We need room for the treasure anyway. Aha. Uh -huh. Uh-oh. Don't, 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 don't. Oh, no. Little lady, you shouldn't have done that. I didn't know that could... Infect now, disease, that's interesting. And we'll have to keep a torch or two spare in case we run into the mists of Ravenloft. I'd completely forgot about that. You know what? Let's play this one slightly differently. 
Yeah, go Vernon! Uh oh. Vernon is now the centre of attention. Now we know he loves it, but sometimes it's not so good for him. Oh, that's a lot of dodge. Uh, this could be bad. I am not going to complain. She did something nice. Yo, everyone just watch out. They're kind of dangerous. And by kind of dangerous, I mean extremely dangerous. If they get their teeth and fangs into you. Alright, there we go. Good start. Good start. Good start. I mean, those, her, those two trinkets compiled together just give way more healing than we're probably ever going to need. But... Oh, girl, you're missing everything. That's pretty bad news for us. Uh-oh. They're all getting a Cadbury's boost. If Cadbury's was blood. Ooh, Vernon, you dodgy git. You know what time it is, Vernon? It's solo time! Do that stage power slide! Alright, alright. You know, we don't even need a group heal at this point. We just need to get some damage in. A momentary abatement. Okay, okay. Wow. It. That works. We're gonna go heal Vernon because he might just need it. Look, no, not heal guard. Unbalanced. You caused him to take stress damage. A not inconsiderable amount of stress damage. Wow, those wings are virtually translucent when they flutter. Okay, it's time to face the music! Annihilated. Oh yes! Go Vernon! That's how you do it! Grievous injury, palpable fear. I was hoping for healing crit there for the stress relief. Nice damage, it's a start, it's a start, it's a start, this won't be enough. But we can try. Nice dodge there, Rosnav. I must say, I do like this music track, it's really got me kind of tapping my toes. Well, more my heels, but yeah. Yeah, doing that sort of heel tapping where your toes are virtually the only part of your foot remaining on the ground. Gotcha! Is broken. Yeah, I you, you horrible little insect. That's right. This oh. expedition at least promises success. Okay, look, let's take a look at the dungeon here. We're gonna be coming back round this way and looping around to there, probably. In which case, we should try and take some of this stuff and say, hey, look. You know what? That's only one more shovel. There you go. That'll do us. We should have lit that torch before going on towards our next fight. Oh, not an ambush. Okay. You don't get anything from us today, stranger. Packs laden oh. with loot are often low on supplies. But we do. That was unexpected. I didn't have time to what was it, sensing no contagion or something? It's like she's contagious. Well, she's infected alright. Okay, what we got? Okay, we'll just take those. None at all, and be on our way. V 
that is a deviation from the pattern. That is a significant deviation from the pattern because that room is missing. We'll save this for our return journey. Presuming we get a return. Oh, wow. Okay, you know what? Rosnav, make a start now because you've got stress that needs shifting, buddy. Okay, this is... As long as it's not the buried ones... Look, the squires can be nasty, chevaliers can be nasty. Double a squire? It's been a while, but... At least there's only three enemies. Alright. Impressive. Can you bleed, monster? Yes, you can. This could potentially become a problem, as they are going to suck up our blood. Ooh. Kill it, bang, and the dirt is gone. Take it! Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Nice one, Vernon. All right, all right, all right. There we go. Group heal. Compassion is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. Now, Sir Rosnav, finish him. A powerful blow. And he does. Excellent. As victories mount, so too will resistance. That's quite a lot of rubies. You know, we can leave the protection stone for now and press on without it. Oh, empty room. Wasn't expecting that. Okay, okay. This is... If these are both locked rooms, or then we have a bit of a problem. Oh, we have a problem. She's doing something bad. She's diving into that thing and pulling out enemies, wrenching them out into battle. Oh, go Vernon, it's one of those times. Yeah! Keep dodging, Vernon. 74 dodge is insane! It's a lot more than 31. All right, gotcha. Twelve. Oh no, no, it's more than twelve. Okay, we can't kill it with Rosnav now. Can't anyway. It's too far back. But we can set up a trap. Multi trap. It's like multi pass, but less tacky. Go, Vernon. It's not your birthday, but you can murder a monster. Destroyed. I mean, you kind of look like one yourself. Just to be honest. Obliterated. Wow, I've put a lot of anti-bloodsucker trinkets on her. That was a little disappointing. Alright. Do it. And we need stress removal now. Nice. Be wary. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. Okay, so that's actually quite a lot of money. Let's swap those for it for now. And press onwards, and if it comes to a point where we seriously... Rosnav, you know what to do. So yeah, we fall back if, like, someone's on death door with Blight and we can't fix it, and we're out of combat. 
you know, basically if things are looking really bad. Just like it did for that poor sod at the back there. <laughs> he is deaded. A time to perform beyond one's limit. Yeah, that could be a slight problem. And immediately we get the blight. Of course we do. Why wouldn't we? <laughs> Lady get angry. Nice. Alright. Alright. Work on the stress there. Gotta keep it all under control. It's all about estimating the odds. Understanding the risks and knowing when you can afford to take big risks like that. Now Vernon's got like low health, relatively high dodge. He's basically the Warhammer Quest elf. Has that been you? No. Okay. Haha. All right. Got gotcha. Wow. Wow. Absolutely going. Ah. Better guard, oh, Rosnav. The blood quickens. Ooh. Vernon dodges everything. For now. But when stuff does get through and hit him, it really shows. The wounds of war can be healed, but never hidden. Ghoulish horrors brought low and driven into the mud. Alright, this is starting to get ridiculous now. We might actually have to leave. Um, let's just trade that. Who needs this? Um, craving. Craving Dale. So red the vampires want it back. That is a orange or red lock. So yeah, I'm thinking both these doors are locked and they lead to something up either here or inside here. It may even be our final destination. So with that in mind, I think if we can get back to the northern portion of this little oval via up oh, come on look we're right here in front of the door so yeah I do hope that in Darkest Dungeon 2 when it comes out they make it easier to click on the bloody doors when you're standing in front of them instead of the characters standing in front of the doors who to be fair often do need clicking on while standing in front of doors but the selection is like way up here and I understand why okay and you my lady get to cleanse one of these and purify your soul somewhat excellent yeah so this is what I'm talking about up there this is where the mirror breaks down hello Yes, we did bring holy water and we haven't used it yet. Wasn't that nice of us to bring enough for everyone? That was incredible. Oh, Senna, why? Okay, well, you know, we've got plenty of money. Not going to complain there. Might as well light a torch. Oh, hey, hey, hey. No, not again. We might have to look at her quirks. Uh, wouldn't be a, nah, paranormania. That's what it'll be. Okay. 
Okay, good to know. And we do still have some space to dig through this rubble. Oh, this is beautiful. Right. Sure. Let's remove even more stress. All right, fairly standard enemy setup for this area. Now he's going to be a nuisance. No, we're going to do it this way. I'm I'm going to go for the Iron Swamp. A brilliant confluence of skill and purpose. And I'm so glad that I did. We'll see what ends up at the back. Oh look, you're at the back. You're gonna die a little bit. Not enough apparently, okay. Now he can do a lot of damage. So we are wanting to get as much damage as him as possible before he sucks up a load of our blood and gets some health back. Like that. However, he has been debuffed by this. What has he done to himself? Gives him reduced speed and accuracy. Well, okay. Oh, he got axe accuracy. All right. Okay, okay. We're probably leaving shortly after this fight anyway. This dungeon is absolutely massive. And it's more about strip mining it for assets than just trying to survive. Because this is a dungeon we can return to. And so return we must. And frequently too. Steady on Vernon, they almost hit you. So much for almost. Ah, can we get it? Yes, we can! Nice! Five and sixteen. Sixteen is bigger than five. It's amazing. Twenty-three percent crit chance is very big. Practically one in four. so clearly in view or is it merely a trick of the light I'm g we're gonna just leave in that room let's head that way no not for oh my goodness really mm, you shouldn't have done that oh well and this one does not require a key, provided there's no fight in here, we should be nice, safe to continue, but there's one right outside the gate. You know what? Let's let's go for it. I mean, this should be kind of contemporary to this. Oh, okay, it'll be interesting. No diggers, so we're okay there. Uh, chevaliers. Or Cavaliers, to use the correct English terminology. Alright, that's eight. And so she's theoretically dead unless she transforms. She's probably going to transform. I should have gone for Riposte there in case they went for the Rapier Skewer, but I think they're too fat. Yeah, there we go. Oh, nice! About to break. We're actually somewhat threatened. Mm. 
I know I should probably be leaving soon, but the music is encouraging me to stay. You know, get angry. You need the healing. Crit heal on the self angry. Hey, <laughs> nice. You can repost, I can repost too. Compassion is a rarity in the fever pitch of battle. Please don't get knocked back, you got knocked back, that's not good. Oh well. A slow death. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. Wait. Wait. Can Finale be used from rank 2 now? It can! You can't repost if you're dead! Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. Okay. We do actually have bandages. No, no, just... Uh, Could've got a camp out of that. Oh well. No fight. And please link up. Yeah, that, that looks like it's linking up. But we are going to be heading out. We've completed a fair portion of the dungeon and we've still got I mean look we've we've done all this massive section up here done a load round here we want to get back here and explore this bit and hopefully that will come round oh no it can land there somewhere okay well look let's head back to town and bask in the rewards of our success wounds to be tended Lessons to be learned. Alright, that turned out relatively nicely. Not gonna complain. Anything really nasty. Fated uh, chance to turn any miss into a hit. Uh, apparently it's like a 5% chance or a 10% chance or something. It, it's not the same, it's not a reroll, you know. Uh, flawed release. Ugh, okay, we might have to fix that. Weapon sinker ain't gonna do anything at top level. In time, you will know the tragic extent of my failings. So, lots of people thirsting for the blood. Nothing really bad happening. And let's look and see who could do with a nice treat here. Well, that's going to be these two, isn't it? I'll go with you. We can fix that. And you can fix that. And then one of you is getting a nice little treat as well. Scattering ain't going to matter for a man at arms, really. Um... Nervous absolutely should be fixed. Okay. I mean, do we have... Sure. Let's give her a clutch hitter. It might come in useful. Well, all right. That's where I'm going to leave it for this episode. And we'll be picking it up next time. I hope you all enjoyed this one, and I'll look forward to seeing you in a future episode. I'll say bye-bye for now, and cheerio!